Let's see what's down below, even though this hurts. Ouch. All right, let's see. The ones that I'm planning on doing, and of course way in the back, you see campfire stories. Um, you see the two things I'm trying to get rid of. DVD and book. Uh, let's see. Oh, there you go. I don't know if I can get rid of this one. Apparently one of the discs sucks. I wanted to do this as an April Fool's joke. This one's actually more gross than Goosebumps, believe it or not. Hmm. Okay, that can go in there. <laughs> I guess. There we go. I'm actually reading this now, kind of. And I really want to actually check this out. So, yeah, then after that, I'll most likely get sick. <laughs> and someone might be asking, where is the two you bought previously? Right here, hiding softly. I think I might have to check to see if there's one down there, which I think it might be. Oh, yeah, there's one in here, too. Yeah, there's the pin. And way in there is most likely a piece from the east. And the pin... I have the original Night Living Dummy, um, first two of the, whew, first two of the Horrorland series, and also a Monster Blood, because I have so many of them. Alright, give me one second. Not sure if it's in here, but if it is, don't think I have it here still. It's a copy of the original Night Living Dummy. I think I actually moved it, so that's good. I think it's most likely in that tin now. Phew, and that's everyone. It's everyone and everything that I got. Of course, one thing I definitely will get rid of after I review them is these books. The Bone Chillos. Not Goosebumps related, but on the other hand, they did come with... Phew, Pasadena, so... Oh man, there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed. That is technically the collection of 2019. If lucky, I could actually slim it all the way down to having it in one just box or briefcase. Oh man, I had to work out. <laughs>